important to understand, though, that for chemical evolution, prior to the origin of replication, you cannot rely upon natural selection to improve your system. You cannot say, oh, those that are better able to survive in reproducing will tend to do so, and that will lead to you know, more efficient replicators or more complex replicators or whatever you might say, all right? Because there is no replication prior to the origin of life. So that's a problem for origin of life theorists. All they have for the chemical evolution part of the evolutionary story is basically blind chemical reactions and chance, okay? That's all they got. They got chemistry, physics, and chance. They don't have any biological systems officially operating, replicating to give you that Darwinian process yet. So I would say that, you know, building complex features prior to the origin of life is actually, you know, as hard as it is for Darwinian evolution to build something like a complex molecular machine, it's even worse for chemical evolution because they don't even have natural selection to rely on yet.